$5 million net worth at 33 years old. If you are trying to build wealth and get rich in your 20s and 30s, then you need to listen up because today I am sharing the biggest mistakes that people make that cause them to lose a lot of money. If you want to get rich, you don't want to lose your money. A lot of people start investing because they think it's the easiest way to get rich, and it is. But many people are making these fatal mistakes. And I see this shit rampant all over TikTok. So today the mistake I'm talking about is picking individual stocks, meaning using your money to buy shares or stocks in a single company. I hear videos telling people just buy what you know, but this is horrible advice. Just because you know of a company doesn't mean that it's doing well. And just because a company is doing well today doesn't mean it will be in the future. And here's the secret sauce to getting rich with investing. The companies that you invest in have to do well for you to make money. So simply put, when you are investing in individual stocks or individual companies, I'm gonna say you're not investing and you're actually just gambling. And that means your chances of losing money are like any other game of chance. But when I talk about how much money you can make investing in the stock market, I say it's about 10% a year on average. When I say this, I am talking about the entire stock market, not a single company. Why? Because some companies are gonna do great and some companies are not. And trying to figure out what's gonna do what is a losing game. Even the pros, the economists, the people that study the market day in, day out, they cannot get this right. And thinking that you you can consistently predict the market better than top economists. That's a losing game, my friend. That's a cognitive bias that's gonna cause you to lose money. So instead of trying to find the needle in the haystack, like which company is gonna do well this year, you just buy the whole haystack which again has shown to return an average of 10% a year, which is great, especially when you don't have to work at all for it. And now here's the thing, trying to buy all of those companies, right? There's thousands of them individually. That would be a lot of work and that would cost a lot of money. There are close to 4,000 companies alone in just the US stock market. So instead, what you can do is buy an ETF or exchange traded fund. This is like a basket of stocks and you get to buy the entire market with a single click. Let's go to my office because I wanna show you an example of this. So here we have VTI, it's a Vanguard Total Stock Market ETF. And from buying this one ETF, you get to invest in over 3,800 companies. Here's the growth of VTI since the early 2000s. If you had invested $10,000 in January 2010 into VTI, your investment today would be worth about $50,000. That's an annual rate of return of about 12% a year. If you are ready to keep learning and grow your wealth the right way, then take our free ultimate investing masterclass. If you've already taken it before, this is updated. There is new information. It is going to change your life. Grab your spot through our link in bio. This is only going to be available for a short period of time.